Okay, so as many of you guys know, I upgraded my computer. My now has a 3060 Ti instead of a 1060 graphic card wise. So I've been going back, revisiting some of the games and everything, and every game has run better in some way, or at least the same. But I think I found the one game that actually seemed to run worse the more upgraded your computer is. And that is this game, okay? I know what you're thinking. If it runs so bad, why are you playing it? Because this is Insane Aquarium, I believe. If I'm not mistaken the name, I grew up playing this game. So basically I'll show you how it works as we continue along. We're going to start the adventure. Basically we have to feed the fish. We have to click on these enemies to destroy them. We have to collect these eggs in order to actually get new things to help us. So Right now, we will feed that fish and feed that fish. Now, feeding actually does cost us a bit of money, as you can see in the top corner there. So we definitely got to keep that in mind. And if we don't feed the fish, they do actually die. So, yeah, it's important that we feed them and we just wasted some money and let that fish can hurry get there. Okay, cool. The bigger fish can actually drop money, so that's good at least. So they're essentially paying for themselves, I guess. Yeah, they're essentially paying for themselves. Then see that fish right there almost died, which is not good. That's actually telling us we should buy a fish, so I guess we'll buy a fish. Maybe that fish, okay, both fish need fed, okay. So we fed both of those fish. Okay, feed that fish again. Okay, it looks like that fish is hungry as well. We have to keep clicking. So this is one of the earlier first clicker games, I guess you could argue. But, yeah. Okay. We are going to see which fish want to take the bait. Okay, that fish dropped even more money because the gold coins are actually worth more. I forgot how fast they drop the money. I can't always get to all of it. And if you don't get to the money, they just disappear. So that's a bit annoying. But we did just complete that because that was tutorial mode. Okay, so the um, snail roams around the bottom of your tank catching coins that you may have missed. Okay, good. We need that, actually. That is very good. On this level, you will meet your first alien opponent. Now, aliens can't eat these little dudes too, but they can eat the fish. So, that's, that's a bit of a downside as it were. We'll try to capture the coins ourselves, but it's nice to know that if we miss some, we do have a snail here to sort of help us get that. Danger, danger, danger. See, I usually like buy an extra fish just in case. We can lead them Okay, okay, they did eat one fish, unfortunately. Very unfortunate for us, because that means we'll have to buy another fish. There we go. 
Here the snail, keep in mind, so he can't be everywhere at once. He tried to get what he can. Ah, that fish died. No, we got to pay better attention. We got to feed our fish. I can't believe we let one die already. It was just, we were literally just on level two, on stage two. So, and we already let a fish die. Wow. Okay. Good, good, good. That fish did not die. That's always good. We can upgrade our food quality as soon as we get more money to upgrade our food quality. Okay, we almost got enough. Okay, we do have enough. Let's upgrade our food quality. That means, oh, that means we could drop more at once. No, he ate one. I mean, he did drop a diamond, which is good, but at the same time, he, he defeated one of our, yeah, we actually needed that one. Okay, let's upgrade how many we can drop at once. Okay, so we can drop two at a time now. We basically just wasted money, but we can drop two at a time. That dude has to be hungry. Yep. Okay, there we go. With that, now we should definitely get another fish here. And one of them will eat one of those, presumably. Okay, so now... They both want to eat some food. Where were you before? When I actually needed you to eat some food, huh? Okay, let's see once again. Okay, that dude, that dude, and that dude. Okay, we fed the fish. We only upgrade this. Okay. Okay. Okay, there we go. And we'll drop some food for you. And some... Oh, none of you are hungry right that second. Okay. Okay. We'll buy one of these parts then. See, we got to buy the egg. Okay. So, let's see. That dude, will he make it in time? He did get his food in time. Okay, good. Okay, and I assume that one is hungry by now. Okay, man, we are rocking this. We are doing good at this. The audio keeps cutting in and out for this, but I know it's the game. I know it's not my audio, but it is a bit annoying. I wish, I wish PopCap Games would actually release an update for this game but I do understand that it's a very niche game niche game and I'm surprised that it, I was surprised when I found it on the Steam store to begin with now I'll actually put a link in the description to it on the Steam store because it's crazy that it's even on the Steam store Okay, there we go. Oh, wait, we are, we are about done. We just need a little more. Okay. I will try not to kill any more fish. And, guy, we are done. We did it. We completed it. The oyster. The oyster produces pearls that you can collect on for a hefty sum of money. Okay. Okay. I'll take some hefty money. Yeah. Okay. Don't want that fish dying. So we got to feed them. Is it feeding time again? Apparently it is. Okay. Is it feeding time again? Apparently it is okay don't worry i can feed you as well i can feed everyone okay that may not be true okay gotta get this pearl 
Okay. Fed them. Okay, good. That fish made it in time. So close to not making it in time. Okay, let's see. And that fish. And we should definitely feed that fish as well. I feel like it wants me to buy another one of those. Or at least wait until the fish get big. Yeah. Okay. We will go ahead and buy one of those. Okay, we have to defeat our first enemy now. Okay, let's see. Yeah, we did it, guys. We did it. We defeated our enemy. I know what it wants me to do, so... I guess I have no choice but to do it. Yeah, I guess I have no choice, unfortunately. I wish I had a choice. Okay, let's see what we have here. Okay, we fed all the fish. Now what it wants me to do is buy one of these fish. Now these fish eat fish. They eat baby fish, particularly. See? That's just what they do. You know, it's survival of the fittest and all that. Okay, I need to upgrade the... But see, they drop, um, diamonds. Okay. I need to be feeding the fish and getting the diamonds because I need the money. Don't take my prize fish. Okay, so good news he didn't take my prize fish. Bad news he took all the other fish. <laughs> so yeah, that that was unfortunate. And this game is not one of those auto collectors. It literally has you interact. If you don't interact, you don't get the thing. That's basically what it is at the end of the day. Okay, we can actually get one of these, which is good. We have to do more fish so he can eat the other fish. Collect another pearl. Ah, we missed the diamond. We literally, uh, yeah, so we can get more diamonds. Okay, there's another. Okay. This will hopefully make it so he gets the fear faster. Yep. Laser upgrade. I had to do it, guys. Okay, let's do that and get some more fish in. Okay. Feel like we're doing okay right now, but we're not doing the best. It's getting a little chaotic. And after this round, we're probably gonna call it a video. But yeah, this is getting quite a bit chaotic as you are seeing. And see, since he doesn't eat the baby fish that often, the baby fish end up becoming grown-up fish. And that's not good because if he doesn't eat his fish, he dies. And if he dies, he's my main money maker right there. Yeah. Okay. 
I used to just buy a bunch of these and just, you know, kind of always putting them out type thing. Okay, there we go. Got that. Just in the nick of time, too. We almost, we're almost good to go, guys. We almost got enough to go ahead and buy the last part of the egg that we need. Oh, yeah. And we have found. Let's see. At oh, it helps me attack aliens. I forgot about this, dude. But, yeah. So we're going to go to the main menu. And that was Insane Aquarium. Definitely let me know what you guys think of this game. Honestly, I am happy I got to revisit it. it I did have to do a, quite a bit of troubleshooting before I could play it. Because of the fact that it's such an old unoptimized port to Steam because it used to be a browser game at some point. So yeah, let me know, comment section below. And with that said, I will catch you guys in the future. Later.